Maurizio, disappointing result. Give us your thoughts on the performance. Our first half, I think we played well. I think we created the best, the best chances. We didn't concede one chance for Wolf. Disappointing because we didn't score. You know, if you don't score, it's difficult to win games. We've spoken about it before, haven't we? Being clinical when the chances come. That was the case again today. Yes, today we were not clinical enough. And I think with the chances that we had in the first half, we should score and, and open the game in, in, and to put the game in our side. Disappointed because uh, we start uh, not so good. We concede few with some mistake. We concede few few corners and and we concede and at the end yes uh, they increase the belief and we start to be tough to break down the block uh, defensive. Uh, but I think we are still creating chances, but we didn't score until today. Coming, uh, Crystal Palace game coming up in a couple of days' time. You're going to be without Palmer and Sterling because of suspension, so you're going to have to be a bit of shuffling of the pack. Uh, yes, these are the circumstances that we need to accept and we need to adapt. And, and of course, uh, we are going to try to find the, the best balance for the, for the team and for sure we are going to compete. Another injury with Leslie Gachukwu going off. Any update on him? No, I will need to assess him, but I'm very disappointed because it was a, a player that we were recovering, but with all the circumstances we forced to we were forced to play with him. Um, yes, yeah, sometimes when the player came from, from injuries, we need to be careful, but all the circumstances, Caicedo, Enzo, a different player, Lavia, I still cannot play uh, outside. Was, uh, we were forced to play with him, um, and of course, disappointed because he was a player that uh, can help for the next few games because it's a busy period. And we are maybe lost, uh, we are going to lose him. I guess the big positive from today is Christopher Nkunku coming on and, and getting his first goal, and, and that's big for strikers, isn't it? For the first goal to come early on in yes, the career. Yes, uh, yes, of course. I uh, hope that he increases his level and is improving every day, and yes, and to, and to help the team to yes to, to win games. That's what we want. And finally, yeah, a word on our supporters who, who've travelled today. It's not been easy for them to get here. A really good effort for us to, to sell out the away end and come and support No, the amazing. The, the fans were there supporting us. And, and of course, uh, it's, it's, it's not nice to play uh, in this day, but I, since I only want to say thank you to the fans because they were very very supportive with the, with the team. And yes, hope to... To, to get uh, to get a different result, but now it's, it's about to reach the best and uh, of course to say thank you because the support today was amazing for, for them. Chelsea are their own worst enemies, um, you know, in the past. Was it kind of like that today? Sorry, you know. You said for Chelsea are their own worst enemies. Was it the same today? I don't understand. Because you don't understand what I'm saying. What? You can repeat uh, slowly. Chelsea are their own worst enemies in the past. Um, their own enemy? Yes, almost their own enemy. Yeah. Um, is it like that today? Were they? Did you did you lose the match through your own actions? Yeah, of course, that uh, we made a mistake. Um, we need to blame ourselves. That is why we didn't win today. Because on the first half, I think we created the chances. We had the chances to score. And in Premier League, if you know, are clinical enough, when you have the opportunity and the chances, and then uh, you always you can concede. And then um, I think we didn't compete in the second half, on the first five, five minutes, I think we concede too many corners. Um, and in this moment, it's about to compete better and to be stronger. Because in the moment that you concede, of course, you give the belief to the opponent, uh, you start to I start to, to be rush in your decision, I start to attack and sometimes let the opponent uh, to counter-attack you and uh, and to transit fast. Uh, yes, of course, I agree with you that we are our own enemy and I think today because I think we lose the, lose the game. I don't want to take any credit to, to Wolf because they score and, and of course uh, they uh, they do they they did the the they shop, but I think in this first half we were better side and and because we uh, because of lack of capacity to score uh, we didn't win the game. Um, when Nicholas Jackson went off, the fans cheered that ironically. Um, what do you say to that reaction? And and will you have to 
help him with his confidence? No, I didn't, I didn't hear, but I, I think that we are going to lose uh, Jackson for one month because the African Cup nation. And I think after 75 minutes, I believe, or 77, I, I don't remember when after we we changed him, but I don't, I don't remember exactly the time. I think we really believe because without the spy, uh, space there and, and the possibility to have Nkunku and Sterling inside. Um, but I didn't hear, I didn't hear about the, the fans. I didn't hear nothing about the fans, sorry. In, are you, are you, sorry, are you concerned about their belief or lack of belief in Jackson? The, the fans? But always it's about the expectation. It's how you manage the expectation, how we sell the expectation. If we compare a Jackson with different striker when arrive in his age or um, when arrive to the a new league like the Premier League, I think he's scoring goals or in his performance it's not to blame him. I think we cannot blame him. Um, I think the frustration from the fans, you can accept the frustration because always you know, um, it's about uh, when we no score, it's about the, the offensive player. But I think it's, we need to blame all together. Um, my advice is to blame all all together because it's the team, it's a football, it's a sport, it's a collective sport, and, and we cannot blame only one or two criticize. But in that case, he's young, it's his first season on Premier League, and the expectation is massive, and he, we are in Chelsea. And when you are in Chelsea, Yes, it's the pressure to play for Chelsea and deliver the best job uh, as possible. Look back. Sorry, sir. Um, yes. That said that you've missed the most big chances out of any team this season. How does the manager deal with that when you speak to players? It's difficult because always we talk about to create chances and to provide the team the good, you know, shape, uh, good strategy to to put in the best condition your player to to score. Yes, that is is happened. At the moment, uh, that is why we are so frustrated. And when you are a, a young team, you become more frustrated. And, you know, you you uh, you feel more the pressure, no? And when you play on Chelsea, is that all is about to win? I think it's not uh, an easy thing to manage. That is why it's all about time. It's about to keep believing. It's helping the player to to improve and be more clinical in front to the to the goal. Only one thing we are, what we can do is to practice more and more and more and more, and you know that is is going to arrive with time. And when they, because they have the capacity and they are quality players, that is why they are here. It's only about time to be more calm and relaxed in into the box. No, no, I don't say uh, young play. I said young team, the young team that play together. Um, that is completely different, um, and of course, uh, we have young players on the squad, but we have experienced players. I think the mix is is important. I think we have a good mix. Uh, I think that it's about how you mix, you know, all these players together. That is a process. In the process that we are to try to find them the best position, the best place, the best ball, the best option. To take the, the best option. That, that is about you know uh, time to work and and no, it's not now to you force me to do or to talk too much. But it's about to say yes. Too many things again and circumstances. And yes, and today we have Nkunku first Premier League uh, um, game and a score is good, but he need time for everyone to see Shut his best this, uh, time, and time yes thing. we are in the middle of the competition and the competition always punishes you when you are not you know strong enough okay final question uh, in this section mike Maurice, yeah. are the yellow cards becoming a problem for you if you'll, you'll lose raheem and cole palmer for palace did you think are they a problem for you and also did you think that raheem's yellow was slightly harsh as well yeah for me yes but he didn't deserve, but of course it's a frustration of call. Uh, also, or, or malo gusto. <laughs> they are young, and we need to talk clear, clear, very clear. They are young and they are frustrated, and sometimes they paint the frustration like this. And after they think about the mistake, no. Um, yes, of course, but yes, uh, for me, Rain didn't deserve the yellow card. But now we are going to miss yes, to to play more, and also. also uh, Uchuke, Leslie.